Okay. Okay, so this model is showing the dural folds, and the, dur the dural folds are folds of the dura mater, which is the outermost one of the meninges surrounding the brain, and it's making folds to separate different parts of the brain. This is the first one, which is called the falx cerebri, or the falx cerebri. This is falx, means separation or uh, partition, and cerebri means the two cerebral hemispheres. The two cerebral hemispheres will be like my hand, and this is between the two, so falx cerebri. If you look at this one here, it can go up. This one here is the tentorium cerebelli. The cerebellum should be located here, and this is the tent that's above the cerebellum. So we call it the tentorium, both sides, tentorium cerebelli. If you move with, with, with the falx cerebri and go to the front, you can see this part here. This is just an extension of the superior sagittal side. It's just going for, uh, uh, sorry, of the uh, falx cerebri, or the falx cerebri. So this part is just a part of the falx cerebri. If you look at it this way, just put it back in place you will see that this is just a continuation. So even if this is removed, this is still the falx cerebri, the separation between the two um, cerebral hemispheres. Uh, within the, the, uh, the, the dural folds, there are some parts that are separated for the flow of the CSF. And as you see here, this is the blue uh, sinuses here. This one will be the superior sagittal sinus, and this one underneath will be the inferior sagittal sinus. And both of them are in the mid-sagittal. That's why they are called sagittal, superior and inferior sagittal sinuses. This one here, straight, straight sinus. Okay, and this one here, is a transverse sinus. Okay. All right.